Well, this is one of the many special moments we witnessed over the weekend. Yeah, we thank everyone who took part in our annual holiday food drive and time now to see the results. Joe Chiodo live at the Food Pantry St. Vincent de Paul. Joe. Hey guys, yeah, what a great event and so much fun to do over this past weekend. And I want to get to those results that you were mentioning right away. How does this sound? How about 8,680 pounds raised and $883 raised? So there are the numbers, but maybe you're more of a visual learner. Let's zoom out and show you the success that we really had. All of this was just put on these shelves today. It took about four hours. This is all of the food that you at home helped donate this weekend at the two high V locations that we were at. We are here at the um, uh, St. Vincent de Paul food pantry where all of this will now get sent to needy families. We have some video that we could show you of the donations taking place at hy V. This is a look at what we did and all of the people that stopped by. The one uh, hy V store we were at was in Papillion and then the other was near 51st and Center. People bringing truckfuls of food here in just four hours to help raise all of that. Again, the totals are 8,600 80 pounds and $883 raised. Now, we are back here live at the St. Vincent de Paul Food Pantry, and we are here with Bruce Noble. You are the food pantry manager, and this is great to see. I mean, these shelves are stocked. What does this mean for you guys? How important is this this time of the year? Oh, well, that's, uh, you know, in November, we had the busiest day, the busiest week, the busiest, busiest month we've ever had. Um, that being said, the need's always there. Mm -hmm. um, that being said, we really appreciate what you've done for us this weekend. And, you know, if you want to do it in a nice summer day again, we would be happy to take it again. And it makes, it's a big deal. We would be happy to do so. It's a ton of fun. Exactly, you know, how many families do you think this could help feed? And what is the process like? Do they come here? And when will that happen? Yeah, that's where well, we're open Tuesday and Thursday mornings. Um, we will see about 250, 300 shoppers come to get a gro grocery cart, go through our little grocery store, choose the food that they want uh, in one week and that uh, they're going to take home food to about 800 family members mm -hmm. so that's a lot of food walking out yeah. of here and uh, this food will last us this is food's going to help us because we spend a ton on mm -hmm. on buying food to give away and mm -hmm. we don't have to spend the money on it now yeah it's, it's nice. right here yeah and exactly. it's a great selection of food too mm -hmm. it is we got canned food pasta peanut butter all kinds of stuff so bruce thank you very much you bet it was a ton of fun so you guys can see it right here all this food behind me now going to be put to use and given to some families who really need it this holiday season john and mallory will send it back to you yeah we should point out mallory did all the heavy lifting while we were there too <laughs>